Now I just got down here uh, to where we sprayed last night. Uh, threw some talc in it because Dad and Gordon forgot it last night. Or, I mean, we forgot it last night and then saw it didn't get any put on the seed last night. So I got that put on. Uh, talc is just stuff you put on the in the seed boxes so it and then it goes down and keeps everything looped up in there it's a dry lubricant is what it is it's so windy out all the time but uh yeah now everything's blown away hang on getting that got that done uh got them all closed just have to watch the depth and get out and take a look at it because the last field was uh soil finished before we planted it so it was easier for the planter to get in the ground but this one we might need a little more down pressure because it's obviously full no-till as you can see. But because it didn't really need tillage and it's a long ways from home, so we just didn't. And then they're just beans, later planted beans, but yeah. might be a little muddle on them tires when we get down here. It's a little muddy once we get off the top of the hill. But we're gonna try her anyway. Uh, hopefully we don't. We, mm, we, I'm 99.1% sure we won't get stuck, so that's good, but uh, we've never actually had this planter stuck, so fun fact, see if it'll fire, I know it will. Oh yeah, yeah, it's a little muddy there, a little bit, but probably plant it anyway it's for planting green except it's going to be brown because we sprayed it but it's green right now so that's the big time no tilling going on jeez looking good a little wet tires are kind of squishy you can see they're kind of shiny kind of went through some mud but that's okay never hurt Try and plant this mountain on this side now. Just flip it back to the other side of the terrace thing or the waterway. Just planting a bean. I got off the mountains and the tiny little short rows. Nicer planting up here. Nicer driving, I guess you could say. But got about 10 acres left here and then I'll be done here. But I don't know if I said this was the last field yesterday or not, but it's not. We got one more to do. I think one more for him. But we'll get to that though when we get to it, I guess. Obviously done at that field there. Uh, headed home now. I may or may not have ran out of fuel on the highway. Way back there, like 20 miles, but or 17 or 15, whatever. That was fun. But the service truck was close by, so we just grabbed it. Went to grab the fuel from it, so that's what we did. Because dad was in town there, my youngest brother's baseball game, so he just came over and rescued me. Now we're headed home, almost there, like five miles away. But nice night out, super nice. Might have got a little out of hand yesterday, it's fine. Well, I sprayed 14 acres so far today. It's the next day now from that planting stuff, but uh, sprayed 14 acres so far. I uh, got another 60 to do, custom, uh, just what a guy wants burned down so he can plant forage stuff on, but it's pretty nice 60 acres, so that's perfect.
perfect for me, but you gotta go to the second farm and fill up with some water and stuff. So I got rinsed out from doing that bean stubble. But what I just sprayed, I didn't I don't think I filmed any of that, but that's okay. So I'm gonna go get filled up and stuff and Gordon is hauling manure. He will be probably all day. There's a lot to haul. Custom manure spreading. But, yeah. Just moving right along. Sprayer finally found high gear and it seems to like it. So, 23 mile an hour. Yeehaw. Made it over to these fields here. There's four fields you have to spray right here. Uh, pretty nice fields as you can see. Should be nice spraying. Bean field here, bean field there, and then there's two uh, triticale fields we had to spray off, so. But it's nice running, so that's good to do. Got the first load loaded up, and we'll get it sprayed off and load up again. We're doing some spraying. Nice, pretty long rows. Just back and forth. It's level ground, too, so I can just put the beans right on the ground, right down by the weeds. I love spraying nice fields, it's so fun. Almost ran over, it went right under the center of the sprayer. Nice little antler there. There's only one. It's kind of a cool little find. Now we're getting the triticale spray. <laughs> Got one field of it done, and this is the last one. Last field of triticale spray, so. I'm gonna keep going. It's a little rough in this field. 